Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with me. Now let's do Rokobi test with the Nissan Leaf E Plus and you see that I'm somewhere else because I have to charge Chedamo and Ionity is back there but Ionity only has CCS and this car only takes Chedamo or Type 2 and it's a 50 kilowatt charger and I can't even start charging with a chip or a card I have to use an app. It's annoying because I got from Nissan a chip to charge for free but I can't use that now. Um, Yes, charge to 50%, we go around as always, come back and then see, I don't even know if I can see the kilowatt hours I charge, I think I can. And charging speed is in the car. Let's just go and do that. I'm on my way and if you didn't know what Rokobi stands for, it's range, consumption and best speed for long distance driving. And what I'm trying to find out is the consumption and the range at certain speeds at 90, 110, 130 and I try to, to use um, the GPS speed, that's why I'm driving 94 and I will then drive 114 and then 135. I have to climb it off, no climate, I'm in eco mode, I'm in D um, and I will make drive around with around 60 kilometers. I've seen that the construction that was the last few times I did the Rokobi test is over so I can do my normal round again. Uh, Yes, and uh, again, like I said, we have our consumption, oh, I was wrong, is here, will be our trip meter with average consumption and everything. And then for best speed, we will calculate your, the, the, the average speed, including charging, and then we know what is the best speed. Of course, car has the disadvantage of Chedamo, um, with the charger, uh, we'll see how that goes. I have a truck behind me that's not going too slow. I'm th maybe it's going one kilometer an hour slower than me. I hope so. The distance is increasing. I hope it stays that way. Yes. Um, like I said, climate off, eco, what else? E pedal is off. Uh, I'm using Pro Pilot going around 30 kilometers in one direction, turn around and then I have to turn around again to get back to the charger because it's right on the highway. I turned around, I did the first it says 29.6. Uh, we also can see now at the end when I'm back at the charger how accurate the trip meter is because Google Maps says 59.9 kilometers. Um, I could drive the 94 kilometers an hour the whole time. I didn't have to slow down once, didn't have to accelerate once. Just of course getting off the highway and then now going in the opposite direction and I always do it with at least uh, uh, as less power as possible but still accelerate to the 94 and in between I drive around 50 so from one highway to another and again I try to drive as efficient as possible consumption right now is pretty high I mean this car has winter tires on and it's 12 degrees the heat is off I had to turn on the climate so uh, on fan one because the window start, started to fog up but heat is off. It's cold in here. Maybe I need to check it soon. Uh, 12 degrees outside. 159 watt hours per kilometer is pretty high, even with winter tires. Even the ID3 that had high consumption with the summer tires was 131, I think. Yes. And the E up that I tested in March had winter tires on. Almost same temperature was 129. So I'm expecting. 130 or something, but I'm almost at 160. Ah, a bit surprised. I'm eco mode. I mean, the light is on, but it's LED. It shouldn't have be any problem. We'll see.
We arrived with 30%. Let's look at the charging speed. Oh, you can see that in the car. To turn it on. And press OK. And then, yes. And then you have to go all the way to charging. 43 kilowatt. That's okay. Charge back to 50. And then we time. I got dark in here. I have this phone here. So this is the time, but 30 minutes more. So I started this at 30 minutes of the timer in the car. So the drive was just perfect, except for the last turnaround where a, a, a car was in front driving. You see it in the video, that was driving extremely slow, but then I could pass. That was the only thing different. Ooh, <laughs> I didn't know that Google Maps does that. I didn't know Google Maps tells you all this stuff. <laughs> Cute. Ooh. By the way, it's 12 degrees outside. Yeah, so how do I... That would be interesting. How do I see the charging screen now? Because everything I press, nothing's there. It's so stupid. Yeah, those, those things don't work anymore that you can use as card, uh, a card. You have to use the car for the percent, we are 34%. We used 20% to drive, what was the trip meter by the way? 60.4, 60, 60 so 500 meters more, that's okay. But 159 watt hours per kilometer is pretty high, even with winter tires. Let's look at the tires. Are there something weird that, it's, that they need so much? What is this? Winter contact. Where's the size? Where is it there? 21550 R17HXL. I know what that means. They look well. <laughs> so I don't know what the deal is with such high consumption. It's an incredible high consumption. Almost done. We are at 49 and we are at, oh my god. 55, almost 56 minutes. Uh, almost there. 50%. And we, 56 minutes. Where are we? Here we are. Charging stopped. 56 minutes. On my way. <laughs> 114 kilometers an hour is the speed I have to be driving now. I just left just a minute ago. Charging print went pretty well. The, the starting with the app is faster than with the car that I on it. So it, the, the charger starts right away, that 50 kilowatt charger. We charged with around 43 uh, kilowatt at 50, almost 50%. I think that's okay for this car. Um, it, the 56 minutes, of course, I, as you can see, I put the average speed down that's the most important let's look at our battery is it hot it's the same temperature as it was before it was cold before i started to drive but that's so cool already two percent yeah that battery is not very accurate we'll see if i can do the 130 even with 50 percent i think so but i think it will need 40 or 45 percent of the battery so it will arrive with five percent it's cool. Everything is the same. Uh, 12 degrees, eco mode. Uh, climate is off. I turned it off because uh, it was even colder with the climate on. And I, I was trying if the f fogging of the windows is still there, but it didn't happen again. So climate is off. I turned around, still driving 114. It got a bit colder, 11 degrees now. Our consumption is very, very high. 186, something's wrong. <laughs> it shouldn't be that high. 
it's really uh, I don't know why and climate I turn it off and then it fogs up again and I turn it on uh, speed uh, fan speed one and then uh, I, I turn it back off again so really I'm trying to save as much power as I can and still now it's 188 huh yeah it's getting cold in here check it is was wise <laughs> But so far, perfect. I had to slow down once, but for like five seconds from 110 maybe to 105. So really not a big deal. Stats. Let's see, with what did we arrive with? 23% and I have to say, kudos to the car, um, I could see that very well. So it showed me, I could see 9% that was 20 kilometers and 18% was 40 kilometers and now 60, it was 27. Good, good. Yeah, those charges just make that horrible noise but it works um, was a, a great route again a great, a great uh, uh, um, trip again <laughs> I can say it um, except for that one time slowing down a tiny bit all always pinned and then just amazing <laughs> I can't complain um, the car is thirsty or the winter tires are horrible I don't know what it is but 189 at 110 kilometers an hour GPS speed, that's pretty high. But I think I can still do the 130, so with the 50%, it should make it. I estimate around 40 to 42% of battery that I need, it's a lot. That means that the whole range of the car will be 150 kilometers at 130 kilometers an hour. The I calculate right? I don't know. <laughs> Let's get in and see what the charging speed is. 43 kilowatt again. I'm guessing that's all it has. At least it gives me that. And what the and temperature of the battery is still okay in the middle. So, so far, no rapid gate. Oh, 44 kilowatt. Oh my God, we're racing. <laughs> but 47 minutes, if it charges from 40 to 50% in 9 minutes, then it's the same with 110, <laughs> uh, with 90 kilometers an hour. There it is, 50% at 53 minutes. Stop charging. I'm on my way again. Now, speedometer 135, which is 130 kilometers an hour GPS speed. Consumption is as high as I thought. I mean, in 10 kilometers, used 5%. Yeah, I'm expecting 40, 42% to use for the 60 kilometers. Let's see if I'm right. I'm just estimating, I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know anything. Yeah, 11 degrees, dry, winter tires, climate is on and on one because the, the windows fogged up again when I was charging and being in the car. Turned around, we're halfway. Consumption is high and we so far we use 17%. 10 degrees now, uh, so far speed was doing very well, so it slowed down maybe to 130, what it says on the speedometer, not 135, two times or so, and that was it. Climate, the same thing, on and off, if it fogs up or not, everything just cool. But consumption is, I mean, that's Model X numbers. <laughs> I, how would I know that, huh? Never driven, never driven a Model X in my life. And I'm saying stuff like that. 
how would I know that? Yeah, don't ever listen to me. <laughs> I don't know anything. We arrived with 18%, so we used 32% to drive 60 kilometers at 130 kilometers an hour. Okay, so that's a third, so 180 kilometers, <laughs> almost exactly, you can drive with a full battery. Huh, so not a long distance car. Um, let's look at the charging speed. I want to see if the car is still charging good, because I charge, this is now the fourth charging stop. The first was only for two minutes, but let's see. Yeah, I hate this okay messaging thing. And music starts with me, yes. Charge plug is connected, yes. Oh. Go, there we go, 42 kilowatt, still charging, amazing. <laughs> Temperature is still okay. Totally fine with me. Charge to 50% and then we'll see what's the fastest. So far we spent 33 minutes. So what was before? 53. So we have 20 minutes to charge to 50%. We'll see if it can beat that. Yeah, above 40% we get the 44 kilowatt again. Huh. So we had 42%. Still 8% to go, but only five more minutes. Come on, focus on this. There we go. So only five more minutes. Can you charge 8% in five minutes? 49%, almost there, charging with 44 kilowatt. We're at 52 minutes. <laughs> so if it's done in less than a minute to 50%, then 130 is faster for a long distance trip. If you can re reach the next charger and you don't charge, of course, to 100% so to, to, I don't know, 60, 70. There we go, 52 and a half minutes. So, surprising. That was surprising to me. And the battery is now warm, but still not cooking. But it, it's way warmer than before. I'm pretty sure next time charging we get Repigate but that's it for me. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day and take care. Bye.